Picture this. Europe in the early 17th century, a time of scientific discovery, religious conflict, and a mysterious order emerges, the Rosicrucians. In the first decade of the 17th century, Europe was a hotbed of intellectual, religious, and political transformation. The Renaissance had ignited a spark of curiosity, leading to an era of exploration and scientific discovery. Yet, amidst the religious conflict and political unrest, a secretive order known as the Rosicrucians first made its presence known. In this era of transformation, two manifestos appeared, published anonymously in Germany that would shake the foundations of society. The first, Fama Fraternitatis RC, or the Fame of the Brotherhood, was an intriguing document that introduced the world to the Rosicrucian Brotherhood. It painted a picture of a secret society with ancient roots, dedicated to the pursuit of knowledge and wisdom, and possessing secrets that could transform the world. The second manifesto, the Confessio Fraternitatis, or the Confession of the Brotherhood, delved deeper into the philosophy and ideals of the Rosicrucians. It spoke of a universal reformation of mankind, of a world united in brotherhood, enlightenment, and harmony. And yet, despite the profound messages, the authors remained hidden, their identities shrouded in mystery. These manifestos sparked a flurry of curiosity and debate. Who were these Rosicrucians? What was their purpose? And why had they chosen to reveal their existence now? The secrecy surrounding the order only fueled the intrigue, leading to wild speculations and theories. The Rosicrucians became a topic of fascination, their enigmatic presence adding a layer of mystery to an already tumultuous era. And so, the dawn of the Rosicrucians was marked not by grand entrances or public declarations, but by whispers and shadows, by cryptic manifestos and unanswered questions. A silent revolution, a ripple in the fabric of society, the Rosicrucians were a puzzle waiting to be solved. Thus, the world first heard of the Rosicrucians, a secret society shrouded in mystery and intrigue. A secret society is nothing without its enigmas, and the Rosicrucians were masters of the cryptic. The Rosicrucians were shrouded in a veil of secrecy, adding to the allure and mystique of their existence. Their cryptic symbols and coded language were not simply a means to maintain confidentiality, but a reflection of their complex teachings and beliefs. The Rosicrucians were not just a secret society, they were a labyrinth of symbols and codes. They communicated through a unique language, a language embedded with layers of meanings, only decipherable by those initiated into the Brotherhood. The Rosicrucian language was not just a tool for communication, it was an art form, a testament to their intellectual prowess and their passion for the esoteric. Their teachings too were wrapped in enigma. The Rosicrucian belief system was a unique blend of alchemy, hermetic philosophy, and Christian mysticism. They held the view that knowledge is power, and this power was not to be shared with the uninitiated. They believed in the transmutation of metals, the philosopher's stone, and the elixir of life, secrets that were closely guarded and shrouded in mystery. The Rosicrucians held a fascination with the Hermetic philosophy, an ancient wisdom tradition that encompassed astrology, alchemy, and theosophy. They believed that this ancient knowledge could provide them with the keys to unlocking the mysteries of the universe, and as such, they cloaked it in secrecy. Christian mysticism was another cornerstone of their belief system. The Rosicrucians saw themselves as spiritual warriors on a quest for enlightenment and divine wisdom. They sought to reconcile the spiritual with the physical, the divine with the mundane, and in doing so, they crafted a mystic tradition that was as enigmatic as it was profound. The deeper we delve, the more intricate the Rosicrucian web appears. Their veil of secrecy was not just a shield, but a labyrinth of knowledge, wisdom, and power. The Rosicrucians were not mere practitioners of the occult. They were architects of mystery, curators of the cryptic, and guardians of the enigmatic. The more we uncover, the more we realize, the Rosicrucian enigma is not just a mystery to solve, but a world to explore. An invisible hand guiding the course of history, that's the power attributed to the Rosicrucians. Let's delve into the depths of this enigma. The Rosicrucians are often painted as a clandestine group, subtly influencing the world's trajectory. From the Renaissance to the Enlightenment, their fingerprints are said to be on every pivotal moment. Imagine the world's timeline as a grand tapestry. The Rosicrucians are not the bold figures in the foreground, but the delicate threads woven into the fabric, unseen but indispensable. Their influence, while not overt, is pervasive, permeating the realms of science, philosophy, and even politics. 
Now let's turn our gaze towards two other secretive societies, the Freemasons and the Illuminati. Many believe that these groups and the Rosicrucians are different facets of the same diamond. Some say the Rosicrucians birthed Freemasonry, others claim they were the architects of the Illuminati. These theories, while intriguing, are shrouded in uncertainty, with evidence as elusive as the societies themselves. Let's consider some key figures from history. Isaac Newton, Johann Wolfgang von Goethe, and even Benjamin Franklin have all been linked to the Rosicrucians. These great minds, renowned for their contributions to science, literature, and politics respectively, were allegedly members of this enigmatic society. Could it be that the Rosicrucians were the unseen force propelling these figures towards their groundbreaking achievements? The Rosicrucians' influence is also said to extend to monumental events. The French Revolution, the birth of modern democracy, even the discovery of the New World, all bear the purported stamp of this shadowy group. But, as with many aspects of the Rosicrucians, concrete evidence is scant, and these claims remain in the realm of speculation. So were the Rosicrucians puppeteers pulling the strings behind the scenes? The answer remains elusive. As we continue to unravel the mystery of the Rosicrucians, remember, what we see is often just the tip of the iceberg. The real intrigue lies beneath the surface, in the unseen influence of the unseen influencers. The Rosicrucians, a riddle wrapped in a mystery inside an enigma. The tale of this secret society is a labyrinth of the unknown, where every turn seems to lead to a new question, an enigma that remains unsolved. The first of these questions, perhaps the most fundamental one is, did the Rosicrucians really exist? With a dearth of tangible evidence and the shadowy nature of the order, it's a question that has perplexed historians for centuries. The only traces of their existence are found in cryptic texts and symbols, like breadcrumbs leading us through a forest of speculation. And if they did exist, who were they? Were they alchemists, philosophers, or simply a group of enlightened thinkers? The identities of these alleged members are as elusive as the Rosicrucians themselves. Their anonymity, while a part of their allure, also presents a formidable challenge to those seeking to understand them. Then we have the question of their influence. How did a secret society, if it existed, manage to leave such an indelible footprint on history? There are theories that suggest the Rosicrucians shaped the course of events from behind the scenes, but without concrete proof, these are merely theories. The lack of evidence, however, hasn't deterred the curious. In fact, it's fueled the fascination. The absence of answers has given birth to a myriad of interpretations, each more intriguing than the last. Some see the Rosicrucians as pioneers of spiritual enlightenment, others as architects of a new world order. The truth, however, remains shrouded in mystery. But perhaps the most intriguing question is, do the Rosicrucians still exist today? Are they still working in the shadows? guiding the course of history unbeknownst to us? Or have they faded into the annals of history, their secrets lost to time? The truth about the Rosicrucians may be as elusive as the Order itself. The myriad of unanswered questions only adds to the enigma, making the Rosicrucians one of the most captivating mysteries of our time. Despite the shadows, the legacy of the Rosicrucians persists, echoing through the centuries. Today, a myriad of organizations across the globe claim lineage to the original Rosicrucian Brotherhood. Each of these groups, in their unique ways, carry forward the torch of the ancient fraternity, keeping its enigmatic principles alive. In the heart of San Jose, California, for instance, thrives the ancient mystical order Rose Crucis, or Amorque. Founded in the early 20th century, Amorque declares itself a direct descendant of the original Rosicrucians, it offers teachings that blend mystical wisdom with practical knowledge, aiming to guide its members on a path of self-discovery and spiritual enlightenment. Across the Atlantic in England, one finds the Rosicrucian Order, Cretona Fellowship. Rooted in the rich tradition of English esotericism, this organization presents an amalgam of Rosicrucian philosophy and theosophical ideas. The influence of the Rosicrucians, however, is not confined to these modern societies. Their fingerprints can be found on the broader canvas of Western esoteric tradition. Concepts central to the Rosicrucian philosophy, such as the interplay of science and spirituality, the pursuit of wisdom, and the belief in an unseen world, have permeated many facets of Western thought. Moreover, the enduring fascination with the Rosicrucians extends beyond esoteric circles. Scholars, historians, and mystery lovers alike find themselves drawn to the enigma of this secretive brotherhood. The allure lies not just in the cryptic symbols and complex rituals, 
but also in the profound questions that the Rosicrucians pose about the nature of reality and the human condition. In essence, the legacy of the Rosicrucians is twofold. On one hand, it is a living tradition, embodied in the organizations that bear the Rosicrucian name today. On the other, it is an enduring mystery that continues to captivate the human imagination, inviting us to delve deeper into the unknown. The Rosicrucians, a tantalizing enigma from the past that continues to captivate the present.